Hey, what is going on, Madden family? We are back. Double, double video today. We got signatures, Roger Saffold and Desmond Trufant. Now, uh, if, if the signatures are bad, we I, I wouldn't look at them. But this Trufant card actually looks pretty nice. Now, he's pretty expensive. Um, but if you compare him to someone like Rod Woodson, he, he's pretty favorable. I mean, he's just a little slower. Uh... And he's got less hit power, but his block shed is good, his hit power is good, his tackle is good. Like, everything about this card is good. He's got better press. So you're trading press for hit power here. That's essentially what the the, uh, the giveaway is. He looks pretty good. I mean, he looks pretty good. He, I wouldn't mind having him. Now, I don't know if I would want him for the price. But, I mean, he looks pretty good. And then Mr. Saffold... I don't know why his strength is so low. It's weird. Uh, but he doesn't really compare to the other 98. You know, he's down 6 strength there. Everything else is okay. Uh, he does have the 2 chemistry, so that's good. Uh, good stamina. Yeah, he's, he's a good card. He's a good card. He's a good card. Not a great card, but he's a good card. Um, I, like, I, I like them both. You know, uh, They could probably be on anyone's team. Now, the biggest problem with today is there ain't no good packs in the stores. Game changer packs are horrible th horrible little things to open. So we're just going to open a couple four bundles and see what we can do. And see exactly what we can maybe we get lucky. Probably not, though. Signatures are uh, hard to pull. They're hard to pull. That would be an understatement. And then we can talk and speculate about possible elite token master tomorrow now we've got to assume it's coming but who is it so we've got telvin so far and t y hilton both cards have power-ups i think that's important when you discuss this both of the cards have power-ups neither one of them was legends so we got to think about non-legend cards that have power-ups. Right? I think that's fair. So we'll go through that after this. Eh, and, uh, you know, speculate a little bit. Some cards who, who probably could use an upgrade. Uh, or power-ups. Uh, you know, we've had one offense, one defense. So it could really be on either side of the ball. And I've seen a lot of names thrown around. Someone like a Richard Sherman, right? I mean, a lot of people have said his name. But I'm not counting out a Movers promo yet. So anyone who's changed teams, I don't think so. So let's take a look. The Bills, I mean, Shady? No, Shady got a card. The Dolphins, Jarvis Landry moved. Rashad Jones got a card. Sue, I mean, Sue could get a card, but I not not for this. He's not going to get, I think we're talking about a bigger upgrade. Uh, it's not going to be any of the Jets or any of the Patriots. No, I think, I think we're getting bigger upgrades. I don't, I, think, I don't think we're going from 96 to 99. I think we're going from like, it was low 90s, honestly. Perfect, no. Dunlap, no, no, no. Browns, nope. Ravens, they have nobody. Yeah, no. Steelers, now we could see an Antonio Brown. But, again, I don't think you're going to get a token master for him. That's not a big enough change at all. Now, I think we will get an Antonio Brown soon. Uh, they're not going to do another Colt or another Jag. So we can just skip over those. Now, Watt could because he's do a power up because he had the, the honors card, but I don't think that's the right time. Uh, and the Titans, Demarco Murray's do a card, but I don't know. I assume he moved teams. Chris Harris is do a card, so we could see a Chris Harris. Uh, none of these guys really. Eric Berry is do a card. But again, I th he's probably coming in a uh, replay set. 
I would imagine. Uh, and none of those guys. So, I mean, it, to me, it seems more like it's going to be someone from the NFC. Uh, could be wrong. Could very well be wrong. But it's got to be a big name. Someone like Landon Collins. Right? But again, he's got a 97. Someone who doesn't have a power-up or a card all year is D R C. I'd put him in my top three for who I would guess tomorrow. And I've seen some other people say Zach Brown, and he's definitely do a card, but his name is not big enough for that set. Unfortunately. Now, this guy, he's going to get a 99 at some point. I could, I could see them dropping that. Jordy is going to get a mover's card. None of the Vikings, none of the Lions, and the NFC South, Deion Jones, 99 overall. I I would take it. Um, I would take it. I would, but to me, it's... Or David Johnson. David Johnson. Look, he's... I mean, he had a Thursday night card, no power up. Could very well be him. Uh, the Rams, mm, they're not going to get one. The Seahawks, the Seahawks. We said Sherman's going to get a movers card if it happens. Earl Thomas, Earl ninety nine Earl Thomas. No, I hope they don't do an Earl Thomas, honestly, because we got Sean Taylor. But, I mean, maybe they do. Maybe they do. But I think it's going to be like one of those cards. It'll be one of the cards that we clicked into, in my opinion. Could be wrong. Could be right. I don't know. I don't know. We'll find out, I guess. I mean, if they do a reveal tonight, they do a reveal tonight, and we'll find out. But until then, and whatever it is they drop, I'll go ahead and I'll, uh, I'll finish the set for you guys tomorrow, as soon as it happens. All right? Sound good? I'm out.